Hey, Shad here with SpeedX, and today we're gonna uncrate the HJC CLY Youth Helmet. HJC is the world's number one helmet manufacturer by volume. It is a Korean company. They make helmets, that's what they do. That is their bread and butter, and I like to go with a helmet that is a true helmet manufacturer, owns their own factories, and knows the business inside out. You've seen this logo if you've been riding for more than a minute, and what that means is it's quality, and uh, they're gonna give you a quality product at an affordable price point. The CLY, anytime you hear Y in the HJC model lineup, that denotes youth, so this is a youth uh, full face uh, helmet that can be used. It's DOT, so it can be used on the street. It can be used with a go-kart, motorcycle, you know, whatever you're putting your kiddo on and want to keep them safe. The important part about a youth helmet, what makes it different, is actually a physically smaller shell, like considerably smaller, to fit a small head. What you don't want to do is take like an adult small or even like an adult extra small, even if it will kind of fit their head it's gonna be heavier, it's gonna be bigger, it's gonna pull in the wind more, it's gonna fatigue their neck, it's gonna to lead to you know more breaks and that sort of stuff, um, more breaks for lunch and snacks instead of more riding, right? It also creates a safety issue. You don't want extra weight on your kiddo's head. So go with a youth helmet. The CLY is a great place to start because it only runs 100 bucks, so it's hard to beat this. The graphics are a few dollars more. They do have some cool looking graphics that your kids will dig. And uh, we're gonna jump in and break this down for you. The sizing goes youth size small through youth large. Go by the HAC sizing chart at speedx.com. And don't forget, we understand shopping for helmets online can be difficult, so it's truly risk-free. We actually pay your return shipping to get the helmet back here, exchange it for the size you need, or just a different helmet refund. You call it, just keep your uh, original packaging, make sure the helmet's new, and we will take care of you. Let's dive in and see what makes this HJC helmet unique. First up, we have ventilation to keep that kiddo cool. Top forehead vents, just switches all the way on or all the way off, pretty straightforward there. Down here on the vent, you have um, a chin bar vent switch that puts air onto their face and onto the face shield to keep that uh, free of fog. Over here on the back, we have exhaust ports whoops, that will let that hot air get pulled out of the helmet and the cold air back in. Face shield, extra large eye port for great visibility. You want them to see what's coming at them. Um, comes with a clear shield, you can get different ones. This is uh, anti-fog and the shield mechanisms on HJC is really one thing that sets them apart. It's, you know, it's a pretty straightforward switch. You just pop that switch, pop it off if you do need to do shield changes. The design is eyeglass friendly. It will fit most kids frames inside this helmet. Uh, I say most because it will depend on the rider's head shape and the, the shape of the glasses, but HJC tries to make room for those frames. Let's flip this over and see how we get in and out of the helmet. Traditional double D ring closure, which will take the kiddo a few minutes to learn, but hey, that's part of riding, kid. You gotta learn how to strap on your helmet. That's number one. So D ring closures are the most uh, traditional and sturdy. So pull, make sure they pull this apart. That's one thing people miss, especially if they're new to riding. When you go to put on a helmet, grab those, teach them to grab those straps and really pull that apart so that they don't rip off their ears and start the day on a bad note. So pull those apart, jump in, because it's got nice squishy cheek pads. You want a snug fit out of the box. Remember, helmets break in a bit. Once they sweat in them, wear them for a month or two, they are gonna uh, compress. That low density squishy foam will compress about 10%, and so the helmet will get a little bit bigger over time. So make sure it's snug out of the box. All right, let's pull these cheek pads out of the way. You can see what else is going on in here. You notice the cheek pad and the, the neck roll are one piece, so if they beat this thing up, you can buy replacement cheek pads from us and uh, basically refurbish your helmet. But one thing moms are gonna dig is that you can keep this thing clean by pulling out the pads and washing them. If you got a gentle washing machine, you can throw them in a washing machine. I usually air dry them, or you can wash them in the sink because the kids are gonna get them funky, let's face it. Gonna be out there in the dirt or sweating in this thing or on the street. We'll pull this headliner out of the way. We have a multi-density EPS liner. Multi-density because there's different impact scenarios. So they use different densities of foam EPS in here to uh, mitigate energy transfer. And uh, like I said, it is DOT approved. So it is legal for the street. And HJC is gonna back all that up with a three year warranty. Head over to to check out the HAC CLY and all the other HACs 
uh, out there on the market. We appreciate you guys watching. Don't forget to subscribe to stay up on the latest moto gear and we'll see you next time to find out what's in the crate.